right, as you see, we have a Mac OS Big Sur version. I just updated yesterday, but I have some issues with this newer Mac OS. So today I want to downgrade from the Big Sur to the Mojave, and I'll teach you how to do that on your MacBook. First off, you need to make a full backup of your entire system, and you can do this by using Time Machine. If you already have a backup, then you need a USB drive. In my case, I'm going to download the Mac OS Mojave on my USB drive. Okay, to download your preferred Mac OS from applesupport.com, I just typed Mac OS Mojave download and the first result, how to get all the versions of Mac OS. That's what I'm looking for. It's uh, support.apple.com. Uh, click this link. The Apple has the links for all the older operating systems. In my case, I'm looking for Mac OS Mojave 10.14. So this is what I would click right now. I click this and this will lead me to the download link in the App Store. Okay, here it is. Uh, I got Mac OS Mojave and here I got the Get button. I click it to start downloading. And we're going to format your USB drive before we go ahead. I'm going to do a search. And in the search bar, I'm going to type disk utility. Hit enter. And you'll see something like this. If you look at the left side menu, that is my USB disk. It's named Windows 8 because last time I used it as a Windows 8 disk. I'm going to format this one first. Do you see Erase on the top? Click Erase. And you can name your USB for this one. Uh, for easy example, for an easy example, I'm going to use USB. And the format that I'm going to use will be Mac OS Extended Journaled. I'm going to use this one and I'll click Erase. It's now formatting my USB disk. Click Done. This USB is now ready for uh, the bootable recovery disk of your Mac OS. And then we need to open up a terminal. Type terminal and hit enter. In here, we're going to write a command. I mean, this command will copy your preferred Mac OS to your USB. So where do I find the commands? It's on the Apple website. I'm going to link this web page in the description section. So please read in the description and click this link to see all the commands that you need. In my case, I'm going to install Mojave. So there is my command. I can just uh, copy this and paste in the terminal. Yeah, for example, if you are installing Catalina, you have to use this command. Or for Big Sur, you have to use the top one. For something else like High Sierra, you have to use this command right below Mojave. And let me bring up the terminal and I'll copy this command. Make sure you change your volume name to the correct one. In my case, it's a USB. Hit enter and it'll ask you to enter password. Now there is a confirmation. Enter Y for yes. Hit enter. Now it's erasing disk and it'll copy the Mojave Mac OS on my USB drive. It'll take some time, but should be done within half an hour. Okay, the creating disk of Mojave has been completed. So I need to restart my MacBook and I need to boot from this USB that I just created. To do that, shut down your Mac and turn it back on. And as soon as you turn it on, press and hold the Option key. Okay, the computer's uh, shut down. I'll turn it on. And as soon as I turn it on, I'll press and hold the option key until I see something. Power up. Press and hold the option key. Now I see this. 
that's exactly what I'm looking for. This is my main drive, so we're not gonna click this one. But do you see install Mac OS Mojave? That's the USB that I just created. So I'll choose this one to begin installation of Mojave on this MacBook. Click this up arrow. Okay, now you'll see something like this. We are going to click install Mac OS and click continue. Click continue, agree. Click agree. It says select the disk where you want to install Mac OS and it'll begin the installation of Mac OS Mojave. Of course, before you do this, make a backup of your Mac because you're gonna lose everything if you install a different Mac OS. All right, that was how to do that. And if you have questions or problems, you can leave comments. I'll do my best to answer your question. Thank you for watching.